Hey everybody, Tom Sparks with Sparks Media Group. Today we're going to try to use the merge tool, which is in beta mode uh, in Matterport, to merge two scans together that was done earlier today. Uh, one of my photographers went to a location and he scanned the inside of a restaurant, a Baskin Robbins ice cream, and um, then he did a scan on the outside, and we're going to try to merge the two together. Uh, we'll take a look at the first one, which is the inside of the store. And you can see that you got the whole inside here. And then we'll take a look at the second one, which should be the outside plus uh, some 360s. So here you have the 360s. And you have the outside of the store. So I'm hoping that there's enough overlap uh, to be able to merge the two spaces together. So what we're going to do is um, select both of them. Hit the merge tool and actually here we can select them again so we don't have to select it on the first one uh, we'll hit continue and here you can see we're showing that one we're going to move it around a little bit. So I'm going to move it there. I'm going to come here. I'm going to turn it oh, ever so slightly. That was way more than I wanted to turn it. Show here. Let's see. You can see it's a little bit off right here. Uh, so we're going to try, let's try to auto align. Snapping failed to automatically find an alignment. Is manually aligned. Okay. Hit the move tool. Now I want to be able to, there it is, incrementally rotate it and we'll keep it there. And we'll go there. And I think that looks good. Hopefully, we'll see what happens. Uh, so once we have this done, we're going to hit Merge Models. You're about to merge multiple models into a single space. This action will create a new space and will not affect your source models. Please review the following processing options before proceeding. What should we call this space? Uh, we'll call it Merged. We'll blur faces. Prevent our automatic alignment from moving your models by locking their positions. Sure, we can try that. We'll hit merge now. It says we're processing merged Baskin Robbins. We're working on merging your models. This might take some time, up to 24 hours, depending on the amount of scan points and your space's complexity. Once the merge is complete, your new space will appear in cloud with the rest of your models. We'll also send you an email notification as soon as it's ready. Got it? Thanks. And it's processing. 
So I will wait for the email to come in and then uh, we'll come back and take a look at it. Okay, everybody, we're back. Um, it's been several hours. It's about 8 a.m. the next day. Uh, I got an email at some point, um, let's see, at midnight that this uh, tour was ready to view. So uh, here it is. We're going to click on it and see what it looks like. So here we have the exterior 360s. Looks like they're somewhat cut off a little bit. We're going to see if that affects how they operate. Walk around outside. Check another one. So it looks like merge worked. Um, obviously, this photographer did not have the door open, so you're not going to be able to walk in and out. Um, so to get in and out, you're going to have to go back to the dollhouse. I think on regular tours with 360s, you're able to go from like here, you can click on one of the 360 bubbles outside and it will take you there. You can't do that on this one. I could be wrong about that. Um, but generally speaking, we have a good merge. I'm going to go through and trim this model up so there's not so much overspray. But yeah, good merge. Uh, if you have any comments, leave them below. Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you find it useful, feel free to share it. Uh, and a subscribe would work if you're not already subscribed to the channel. I'd appreciate it. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.